We're talking balls. Now there's a couple reasons you may want to consider getting an exercise ball. The very first is of course you want to use it for the purpose of exercising because of course, you know, as soon as you sit on this thing, you're going to get abs. This could be a very easy alternative to buying a workout bench. If you want to use this for things such as uh, weightlifting, you can save a lot of money by getting a ball opposed to getting an entire workout bench. And of course, sometimes they're just fun for like throwing at people or <laughs> playing rocket ship with your daughter. That can be a lot of fun. But it begs the question, what kind of stability ball is going to be best? And how do you get the best bang for your buck? Well, that's what we're talking about today. So I have my three balls, small, medium, and large. The very first one is the small one by Beachbody. The second one is a medium size by Valeo, 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 Valeo. And the third one is the larger size by Trideer. Now, the Trideer one is the newest one that I have. And I'll tell you, the reason I like it is, if you don't know, I'm a taller guy. I am six foot seven inches. And I used to work out a lot with the green medium size Valeo ball. When I got down on it, I just was way too low to the ground. And I was scraping my, my fist against the side of the uh, floor when I was trying to do things like bicep curls. So I knew I needed to get a slightly larger ball. Well, I was kind of unskilled in the whole exercise ball phenomenon. And that's why I'm coming today with a video to you to help you pick the right exercise ball. Let's talk about the first thing. What kind of exercise ball should you get? Well, it depends on your height. And I'm gonna put up a little chart here to make it a little easier for you. And I'll tell you, I got it. It came super fast thanks to Amazon. Uh, and you can check out the Trideer balls. They actually ship them all the way up to, I think 85 centimeters down to the smallest thing you can imagine. So based on your height, if you click the link above in Amazon, it'll take you right to the Trideer section of Amazon so you can pick out the right exercise ball instead of having to type and search and ruin your fingers. The thing I like about the ball is you can sit on it, you can bounce on it, and it has a very significant burst rating on it. So that way you can not have to worry about it, you can get right to work, and it, you know, at the same time, unlike a workout bench when you're lifting weights or you're doing yoga or you're doing any type of exercise ball routine, it allows you to work your core, it allows you to work your stabilizer muscles, so I think it kind of adds an extra benefit on top of what you would have had if you just had a workout bench. But as you can see, the difference between when I was using the green ball and when I'm using the bigger Trideer ball, I now have a little bit more range of motion, not only with bicep curls, but even all the way through chest and triceps and other workouts like that. I can get down onto my exercise ball, have a little bit more comfortability, and be able to do a full range of motion. And that's what you want when you're choosing the best exercise ball. One thing a lot of people get confused on is how do I properly inflate the ball? Well, it's actually kind of easy. It comes with a plug that looks just like that. And the cool thing about the Trideer series is it also includes this. Now this will come in handy once you need to pop this out because it literally will go in there and pull it out of the ball. It can get a little bit tricky pulling the pin out of the ball once it's fully inflated. Thanks to Trideer, they come with a little tool so you can pop it out. When you first get your ball, it's gonna be fully deflated. And what you need to do is inflate it, let it sit for a little while, probably about 12 to 24 hours, and then inflate it the rest of the way. And the reason for that is you wanna stretch out the elasticity because when you first inflate it, it's not gonna inflate the entire way and the entire span that it's gonna eventually be. A lot of balls will come with two different ways you can inflate. One is this, where you simply just pull and push and it'll push the air from this nozzle directly into the ball. That does take quite a long time but you're gonna work your, your muscles in the meantime, so you kinda of get a free workout. Now the Trideer ball I got off of Amazon came with this handy contraption. You literally plug this into the opening. It comes with two different fill valves, so you kinda of plug that right on, just like that. Okay, and then you plug it into the ball, and then you can use either your hand, like I'm doing right now, or you could use your foot, and foot prime, the pumping of the air. And you know what's cool about that is, you know, it, it takes a little bit of strain off of you and it actually feels a lot faster. So it's up to you whether you're using this for exercise, whether you're using this for yoga, whether you're using this for the purposes of replacing your chair, or if you're using it for fun, I do actually recommend the Trideer. And this is not a sponsored video, they didn't pay me to do this. I simply went on to Amazon because I was interested in getting a bigger ball. 
got that because it sounded good and it, I looked at their customer service and it seems like anytime there was an issue they were very quick to resolve it for their customers which I always appreciate so I decided you know what it was time people were asking me about exercise balls I'm like it's time to do a review on these things and explain why I chose the try to your exercise ball Again, if you're interested in it, you can click the link above to learn more or in the description below. If you have questions about exercise balls or anything like that, comment below, let me know what's going on, and most importantly, subscribe to become part of the Sweet Life Fitness community. We'll see you next time, guys. Until then, have an awesome, awesome day.